What is up guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Zach. We got another episode of The Journey coming to you today. Today's episode, we got two matches in two different cups. First match against Carmarthen in the JD Welsh, uh, JD Welsh Cup second round. Second match against Seven Sisters in the Nathaniel MG Cup third round. In between episodes, I played one, two, three, four, five matches with mixed form. Clydeac Wasps in the JD Welsh Cup first round absolutely annihilated them. Uh, we even played a relatively rotated squad. Jamie Breeze with a 10.0 and a hat trick. Very good day out for the boys. Then we beat Real 1879 4-1. In the league, went on to lose 1-0 to Landudno and 0-0 to Aberystwyth, both in the league. And then in between those, Airbus UK 1-1, went to penalties, ended up beating them. We went 5-5 five five on penalties. Um, I don't know. Uh, our, our <sighs> when we play well, we play well. When we don't play well, we look like ass. And I don't really know what is causing that. Um, last match, I did start McMill McWilliam instead of Reynolds in left back. That didn't seem to fix the issue, although he did have a good game. He finished on a 7.3. Um... So maybe we will start to play McWilliam a little bit more often. Jimmy Reynolds just hasn't quite done exactly what I needed him to do. Um, he's a very good option as a bench player. But I, just, I don't think we have the, the oomph in left back to really get the job done. Um, also in between episodes, I made one signing... I have no idea how to pronounce that. I'll be honest. Let's Google it. How to pronounce I-W-A-N. Wrong. Um, you in? Is it just you in? It is you in. Okay. Fair enough. Um, that's pretty easy enough. Name Ewan Cartwright um, as a backup right back. He can also play central midfield if we need him to. Good option. Uh, we got him f as a free agent. Um, he signed, I think, on 10 pounds per appearance. So we're cool with that. Uh, we did get a email saying that Richardson isn't confident in our defensive depth. Fair enough, but uh, shut up. That's basically what I told him. He got grumpy. And um, I think he's contemplating not signing a new contract. We'll let him go. I'm not too worried about it. Anything else? I don't think so. I think that's it for now. We brought in a whole bunch of loans. We'll see if anything comes from that. A lot of midfielders, a lot of attackers. One defender. Not ideal. But that's alright. Let's fast forward. Let's get to the match against Carmarthen in the JD Welsh Cup. We will be starting Carmen Evans. Um, when's our next match? Saturday against Denby in the league. That's a pretty important match. Let's rest Manny Judd and star Edwards. Sure. Let's go with that. And Mick William at left back. Let's go Josh Keys at defensive midfield and 
Josh Maloney. Josh Maloney there. And we'll go with that for the match. Starting lineup, Carvin Evans in goal. Defense of Taylor Davies, Tom Davies, Callum Winchcombe. He Hayden McWilliam. I knew it wasn't Heath. Hayden McWilliam. Midfield consisting of Josh Keys, Josh Maloney. Ryan Edwards? Ryan Edwards. I'm terrible with names, by the way. If you haven't figured that out, awful with names. Up front, we got Rio Dyer, Adam Jones, Jamie Breeze. Let's submit the team. Let's proceed to the match. That all looks good. Nobody sticking out. Cool. Do, 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 do. Let's um, go out there and put on a worthy display, shall we, lads? <sighs> Karma Thin starting off with the ball going right to left. Asamoa going over to Jenkins. Toure back to Jones. Westbrook trying to go in the air to As Asam Asamoth Asamoeth. Don't remember his name, but anyway, Asamoa. There was no th at the end. I was close. Dyer with a corner near post. Could not win the header. Toure looking to start a counter attack. Checks up. Brings it to Shaw and Shaw Benny. Westbrook out wide to Alshorn. Wide. Puts it into the box. Toure wins the header. Goes very wide. Evans had it covered. Knew where he was. Knew where the, uh, where the goal was. Knew where the ball was going. Did not need to exert any effort. And we get in the highlight. 15 minutes into the match. One shot so far. Across both teams. Now we're even 1-1 one, one on shots. Nothing on goal so far. Azamoa tackled in the box by Callum Winchcombe. Barrett has the ball. Gives it to Shaw. Jenkins top of the box. Takes the shot. It's a good effort in the end. Tom Jenkins scores his first of the season. Very powerful shot through traffic. Karin Evans dove, but couldn't quite get there. Tough shot to block in the end. Um, defense not doing their job. Not sure what Maloney was doing. Just hanging out there. Dyer has taken a slight injury. We will try to wait to till halftime. To make that change. Leg with the ball. Up to Jones. To Noakes. Cuts inside. Over the top to Torre. Brings the ball down. Takes the shots over the bar. We got away with that I think. Let's offer some encouragement. About 10 minutes left of this first half. Nothing coming. Seems to be a pretty even match. So we'll take that. Um, dig in. Dyer is anxious. He's not showing any sort of injury notification so we're gonna ignore it for now get back to the dressing room let's go start the second half let's offer some encouragement right out of the gate try to lift the spirits a little bit um, I think the lads are feeling the pressure of poor form we just have not been uh, doing the uh, doing the job out on the field for a couple matches now Evans, big ball over the top. Looking for Jamie Breeze, I believe. It's wasted in the end. Barrett with a throw. Torre over to Asamoa. Gets past his man. It's a good block from Carmen Evans. 
It's a corner kick incoming from Carnerfin. Real professional over here. Good save from Carmen Evans. Really good save there. Westbrook to Shock Benny. Shaw up to Asmoa. Barrett. Shock Benny playing a little bit of keep away. Jenkins, Shaw, Torre up to Westbrook very quickly. Finds himself in the box. Can't get past his man, but pulls it back. Squares it to Ezio. Torre scores. Carnerfin. Two, landed those nil. Not a great showing for us today. I don't know. I, I, I don't know what's causing it. I really don't. We're just not creating much at all. When we get the handful of shots like that, but the uh, the consistency isn't quite there. That could also just be playing in lower league. Um. A bit of a bummer, but that is it is what it is, man. Edwards keeps the ball in. Let's tell Tom Davies to mark Ezio Torre. Let's see if that helps out anything. Dyer with the corner. Far post. Can't win the header, but it falls to Adam Jones. Looks for the cross, plays it low to Davies. Wasted effort. Um, but it looks like it did take a deflection. It's out for a corner. Keys standing over it. Left footed in swinger. Far post. Winchcomb was there. But couldn't quite get to him. Another effort. Comes off the post. And Connor Finn are looking to counter attack here. And they're actually doing quite well. Good tackle from Adam Jones to stop that. Well done. Let's make a couple changes. Let's take off Callum Winchcomb for somebody. Let's drop Josh Maloney back there. Let's bring on Manny Judd. Swap them two around. You can also Jake take off Jake Josh Keys for Riley Cotter. Uh, Jamie Brees having an awful match. Um. Play a little bit more attacking, I guess. You know what? Attack with that. Let's do this. Support on an advanced playmaker. Let's go with that. Let's see if that does anything for us. 66th minute. We have a corner. Riley Cotter standing over it. Judd to Dyer to Jones. Takes the shot first time. It's a good save from Leg. Puts it out for another corner. Riley Cotter standing over it again. Middle of the box. It is cleared in the end. Davies has it though. Sends it out to McWilliam. First time into the box. Breeze oh, off the bar. Jones. Ah. Ah. Good effort there, boys. Good effort. Yeah, let's play for set pieces. I'm cool with that. Let's offer some more encouragement. And let's go to attacking. See if we can't um, rescue this match. Let's take off Taylor Davies for you and Cartwright. Confirm that change. About 10 minutes left of the match. Riley Cotter standing over yet another corner. Play it short to him. Jones with the ball. Puts it back into the box. Jamie Breeze is there. Can't do anything with it. Could have sworn I took Jamie Breeze off. I guess I did not. 
Let's bring on Stuart Heath and Steven Pedral. Yeah, let's go with that. Pedral with a throw in. Dyer wins the header. Yes, Rio Dyer. Don't go celebrate. Go grab the fucking ball. Oh, he was offside anyway. Dang it. Well, that was our chance right there, I think. Four minutes of added time. I don't think there's enough for us to come back into the match. We'll be knocked out of this cup. Westbrook has the ball. Plays it to Evans Harriet. Shaw. That's full time. Carmerfin. Carmerfin. Not Carmerfin. Carmerfin. Two. Landed low snail. Um, yeah, I'm not happy with their performance. Definitely. Uh, definitely should have scored at least one goal. And that knocks us out of the J.D. Welsh Cup. Let's come back in just a moment for the match against Seven Sisters. See you in a second. Game day, Seven Sisters at home, Nathaniel M.G. Cup. Let's get to it. I don't really want to talk about the match in between. We drew. We were dominating that whole match. We were up 1-0 until the 87th minute. And we gave up a goal. Anyway, next match. Karen Evans in goal. Obviously. Oh, let's you there, you there. Um Maloney on the bench. Your cup tied. You. Um, let's go Reese Evans there. That works for me. Get rid of you, get rid of you. Let's see here. We got some time in between matches, so I'm not worried about fitness. What I am worried about is form. Josh Keys on a 6.58 for the last five matches. You can sit on the bench, my friend. Um, 6.54 from Jamie Breeze. Let's start Stuart Heath as a pressing forward. Um... Nobody else really sticking out. Rio Dyer not having a great run of games. Let's start Reese Evans. I think that's what we're going to go with for now. In goal, Carwin Evans, Tom, Taylor Davies, Tom Davies, Callum Winchcomb, Jamie Reynolds in defense, Riley Cotter, Josh Maloney, Manny Judd in midfield, Reese Evans, Adam Jones, Stuart Heath up front. Let's submit the team. Let's uh, let's get out of this bad run of form, shall we? Come on, boys. Uh, we're the favorites for the for a reason. Let's win. We are going left to right in the first half. Clear day today. Norman with a badass mohawk. 62 degrees. Lee Evans is the referee. 86 people in attendance. Not a great turnout. Jones puts the ball into the box. Lloyd can't win the header. Davies clears it up to Reese Evans. Up to Stuart Heath. He gives up the ball. Griffiths over to Clay. Up to Jones. Looking for the overlap. It doesn't come. Keeps the ball and puts it into the box. We intercept. Very end to end so far. Adam Jones keeps the ball, gives it to Manny Judd, skips past his man, holds it up, takes the shot from range, off the bar, Reese Evans. Oh, just tap it into the goal, my friend. Come on, man. Fifteen minutes into the match, four shots to none so far. We've had no possession. What the hell? Evans on the left-hand side. 
Pulls it back to Norman over to Walls High. It is intercepted and clear, but only to Da Silva. Jones with it. Chips it to Evans. Good effort. Off the crossbar and over. Out for a goal kick. Reese Evans with a bruised shin. Taylor Davies with the corner kick. Looks to the far post or Tom Davies just over the bar. That's what we want. Um, I mean, I'm, I'm always cool with that effort. I think 50% of the time that goes in the back of the net. Griffiths with a shot. We got lucky there. It is cleared, and we in the highlight there. Let's um, try to turn on that instruction. Reynolds, corner, blasts it into the box, falls back to him, puts it into the box. Stuart Heath, weak header in the end. Probably should have done better. Probably take it down, take it with his uh, with his right foot. Judd Evans, long range effort. I think it took a deflection. It did. It's out for another corner for Landed Lose. Right-footed in-swinger incoming from Davies. Near post. It is cleared. Near post corners just don't do anything for us. Ooh, there we go. Evans to Heath. His shot is blocked. Another corner. Eventually we'll score one of these. Um, Reynolds standing over it this time, left-footed in swinger, far post, can't win the header, it's a throw-in for us, about five minutes left of the first half, Heath pretty deep into uh, our defensive half, Davies to Reese Evans over to Riley Cotter up to Manny Judd. We got some runners. Heath out to Jones. Probably should have been a little bit further up the field. Manny Judd scores his fourth of the season. Adam Jones with the assist. It's a good finish from Manny Judd. Heath probably should have played it earlier. Probably played it like over here for Jones to run onto it. But he does well. Grabs it. Slides it over to Manny Judd. He hits the far post into the back of the net. One nail to the good guys just as we go into halftime. Ten shots to four. It's a good start to the match. I know we're capable of better. One change from seven sisters. Davies up to Evans and fouled pretty quickly. About 15 seconds into the half. We have a dangerous opportunity. We don't get to see the free kick but we do have a highlight shortly after Stuart Heath oh that was your chance bud Jones over to Maloney long range effort off the bar a lot of shots hitting the woodwork today Manny Judd wins a header yes and uh, we go out for a corner Davies Roberts does well to pluck that out of the air. Winchcombe over to Tom Davies. Maloney back to Davies. Up to Cotter. Judd tries a slot in Heath, but he gets the ball anyway. Takes the shot. Stuart Heath scores his first. Does the old, uh, was it pat the head, rub the belly, celebration. Hits the uh, top corner. Judd tries to slide it in. A little miscommunication from the, uh, from the defensive midfielder and the defender. And it falls nicely to Heath. He slots it home. He was definitely offside. But once again, we get away with it. No VAR this low in the leagues and we are 2-0 up against seven sisters let's make our first change of the match let's take off Tom Davies he's on 6.6 .6. he's getting a little tired let's slide Josh Maloney back there 
bring on Josh Keys there. Confirm that change. Davies has the ball inside the center circle, chipping it up to Reese Evans. He runs onto it, puts it into the box. Adam Jones is there, wins the header. Does the goalie, he does not get a touch on it. It's over the bar. Goal kick. Clay. Griffiths to Da Silva. Back to Griffiths and Clay. Lloyd now with it. Slides it back to Clay. Now Cornwall. Back to Clay. All of the defenders getting a piece of the ball. Great ball. Great run from Jones. He has stopped in his tracks. But he does square it to Adams. Adam Wallace High. Puts it in the back of the net. Landlos 2, 7 sisters, 1. Carmen Evans does well to not allow the 7 sisters attacker to get the ball quickly and, and restart. Yeah, probably should have done better with that save, but oh well. Reese Evans has a gash lower leg. Should probably take him off. Manny Judd. Really deep, looking to put it on goal. He does. Oh. oh. That was really far out. Wait, hold on. That was about, that was on this line. 6, 12, 18. Um, 24, 30 yards out. Fair enough, son. I hope we're able to hold on to Manny Judd for a long time. He's, uh, I think he's going to turn out to be a pretty good player at this level. Reynolds up to Reese Evans. Squares it. Manny Judd's there. Scores his fifth of the season. Manny Judd's second of the day. Brings us back to two goals up, three to one, to the good guys. Good cross, good finish. Landing those three seven sisters. One, let's make a change. Who was it that is uh, bleeding? Was it Reese Evans? He doesn't have the little uh, injury notification. So I'm going to pretend it doesn't exist. Adam Jones can come off for Rio Dyer. And confirm that. Ten minutes left of the game. Eighteen shots to five. We have absolutely battered the team. Five minutes left. Let's make our final change as we come into second half stoppage time. Let's take uh, Riley Cotter getting another yellow. He's going to be suspended soon. Um, Ewan Cartwright can come on for Taylor Davies. See out the match. Five minutes left. And it goes by pretty quickly. No highlights. We're coming up to the end here. Jones with a corner. Well done from Carmen Evans. Hold on. Hold on to the ball. Just wait for the full time whistle. There it is. Lane of those three. Seven sisters. One. Moving on to the next round. Good win, boys. Let's see who. Anything good? Jo Johnny Hayes. Oh, you're actually really good. Extremely doubtful. He earns 150. There's no shot we get him. All right. Who? Who do we play? Do we know? Is this the pre-drawn one? It is not. Um, let's fast forward to the 
draw, shall we? Heath becomes the youngest ever in Landon Lewis goal scorer. 16 years and 202 days. I was learning how to kick a soccer ball when I was 16. Let's start the draw. Rob Hopley, ceremony host for us today. First out of the hat, Landley Town coming up against Landon Lowe's. That was quick. Airbus UK facing off against Newtown. Colin Bay and Pennebont finally Cardiff met Uni against the New Saints. We will have an away match there. Where do we play them? Bam. Next episode, let's come back for Pennerincock and Lanelli. Lanelli? I don't know how it's pronounced. We'll figure it out by the time we get there. But that's where we're going to end the episode there today. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. All those fun things. And as always, we'll see you later.